Now the Sunny says, I understood that we should do our best and leave the rest to God. But my question is, does God really exist? So now the father says, once one of my friends asked me if I believed in God, I said yes, but he said I do not see him. So I told him this story from the life of Sir Isaac Newton. So here is a story of Newton and his atheist friend. Wow, what an amazing model of the solar system. Sir, who designed it? There was no artisan involved. The model had just popped up by chance. Yeah, why can't the model come by chance? You can believe that the whole solar system with all its celestial uh, bodies, complexity and magnificence can come by chance. Why can't this uh, small model come by chance? True sir, someone must have designed the solar system. So our 13th question is, if someone asks you, we do not see God, why should we believe in Him? What will your answer be? Our options are, if a simple model of the solar system requires a creator, then the actual universe surely needs a creator, God. To prove this, I will tell you the story of Newton. Because most people believe in God, I too believe to God. If we do not believe in God, it is alright. We cannot say anything about whether God exists. So what will be the answer? According to me, I think the answer should be A. If a simple model of the solar system requires a creator, then the actual universe surely needs a creator, God. To prove this, I will tell you the story of Newton.